Every year, Department of Homeland Security agencies sees millions from travelers passing through our nation's airports. Between 2000 and 2016, they seized more than $2 billion in cash and other currency across over 30,000 seizures. Half of these seizures were triggered by simple paperwork violations. These seizures do not fight crime. Regardless of what triggered a seizure, over two-thirds of cases involved no arrest. And arrests were even rarer for paperwork violations, occurring in just one of 10 cases. Of seized currency that was forfeited, over 90% of cases were processed using civil rather than criminal procedures. Worse, vanishingly few of these civil cases received any judicial oversight. It took an average of 193 days for seized currency to be forfeited, leaving victims in limbo for more than six months. In some cases, it took as long as 15 years. Airport currency seizures and forfeitures put innocent people's property at risk. To ensure another innocent American never loses property unjustly, Congress must end civil forfeiture. Learn more about our new report at IJ.org.